Electric vehicles, which include hybrid, plug-in hybrid, and fully electric vehicles, are here to stay. A hybrid is a vehicle that relies primarily on a traditional combustion engine, but also utilizes an electric motor to provide power at certain times, therefore increasing fuel economy. The high voltage battery is recharged through regenerative braking or by the engine charging system. A plug-in hybrid is similar to a hybrid vehicle, except the battery has a much larger capacity and it must be recharged by plugging it in. The advantage is a greater electric-only range, but you still have the ability for long trips without the need to recharge. A fully electric vehicle, also known as a battery electric vehicle, or simply EV, relies solely on electric power with no combustion engine. These vehicles have the largest batteries. One of the first questions many people ask is about safety. EV technology is a safe technology, but it requires a different level of understanding by service technicians and emergency responders in the event of an accident. The primary hazard in these situations is the risk of electrocution. High voltage can kill. Certified EV service technicians are trained in the proper high voltage and personal protective equipment and procedures to remain safe on the job. Emergency responders are equally trained and equipped to safely disable high voltage and work around these vehicles. An additional fire risk stems from a damaged battery cell, which can generate toxic, flammable gases, and in some cases, enough heat to ignite. Thermal runaway is when this uncontrollable self-heating of a battery causes continuous ignition, and because of this, EV battery fires can be very difficult to extinguish. The most important thing to remember is if a battery is damaged in any way by a collision or accidental damage, the vehicle must be parked away from all structures and other vehicles until it can be professionally inspected. Even when visible damage is not evident, any vehicle that has been in a collision should not be charged or parked near any structures or other vehicles until it has been professionally inspected. In the event of a battery fire, call 911. The most important aspect of EV technology is to familiarize yourself with the primary identifiers of these vehicles, including exterior badging and labels, charging ports, under hood high voltage warning labels and cables, and the batteries themselves. There are many services on an electric vehicle that don't involve the high voltage systems, such as rotating the tires, replacing the cabin air filter, installing new brake pads, or replacing wheel bearings, so many things haven't changed. But if the high voltage system is involved, or if you have any doubts, leave service to the professionals. Thanks for watching.